thank you very much for joining me. I'm Mary with Mary Really News. Please like, share, and subscribe. Did uh, any of you feel that swarm of earthquakes that occurred in Berkeley, there in the Bay Area, California? If so, please put your comments down below. Please like, share, and subscribe. A magnitude 3.1 earthquake struck approximately 2 kilometers east of Berkeley, California yesterday at 9.23 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. USGS revised it to a 3.0. Were you one of the 2,255 reports that was sent in to USGS? Did you fill it website? Here's the felt reports. Yeah, it was felt as far as uh, Santa Rosa and as far as San Jose. Because of the shutdown, they're uh, throwing paper airplanes there at USGS and not updating the uh, felt map. So the actual felt map, they don't have the earthquakes. We only have this image right here. This map was probably computer generated. Just another reason why people worry about AI taking away their jobs, but they're not working anyway. So yeah, the computer is um, making such a map. Yeah, we got Sunnyvale, San Francisco, um, yeah, Stockton, um, Lodi. Wow. There is six earthquakes on this map showing the uh, small swarm. 1.9, 9 kilometers in depth or 5.6 miles. Another 1.9, 5.5 miles. 2.0. Uh, that one, let me bring this down so everyone can see. It's 5.4 kilometers in depth. Um, 1.7, 5.5 5 miles in depth. A 1.7, uh, 5.5 miles in depth. A 2.3, which was 5.4 miles in depth. Yeah, it would be interesting to go to the stadium because one of the earthquakes was smack dab in the middle of the, um, the uh, football center here. Yeah, the stadium was built right smack dab on the fault line. If you go there, you can probably see um, damage and more than likely, um, indication of the slow creep creep of this fault line. Kind of ironic because these earthquakes happened less than an hour before California's annual shakeout earthquake drill, which occurred at 1016 a.m. Pacific Daylight Time. Yeah, what a coincidence. The quake produced light to weak shaking across the San Francisco Bay Area from Oakland to uh, San Jose. Um, etc. I already showed you. Um, most intensity was two to three weak shaking felt by some people indoors. Um, they may have described it as like passing of a train. Um, hanging objects did swing slightly. I guess there in Pacifica, California, it was a very light shaking that was reported. One of those in our group here, I want to give a shout out to him lives there in Pacifica. Did you feel this earthquake yesterday morning? No structural damage or utilities was affected. Uh, yeah, did you have damage? Did anything fall off your shelves? I would like to know. Many of you that follow me will remember the magnitude 4.3 quake that struck on September 22nd. This was also along the Hayward Fault. If you want to know about that earthquake, you can go back and Watch that video. The location was right there. 31,795 people said they felt that earthquake. And USGS gave it an intensity level of 4. That one was felt as far as Chico, Yuba City, and as far south as uh, Santa Cruz. A little bit farther, it looks like. This area of the Hayward Fault, and that's where it occurred, um, is in an area where the fault is locked and building up stress. And this uh, 4.3 isn't far from this recent swarm. Are you prepared for a large earthquake? It's not like you're getting uh, forewarnings of something bigger that will come eventually. And this area is past due for a very large earthquake. Are you prepared and what have you done to prepare? If there is a large earthquake, 
Um, a lot of times the cell phone services go down, but sometimes text messaging still works. Um, so you might consider that and have a whistle with you. So if you're trapped in debris, you can blow the whistle and call for help. Make sure your things are bolted to the walls, heavy bookcases, things that could fly off the shelves and hurt you during a large earthquake. Yeah, secure that. Have a tool readily available so you can turn off your water and gas lines. Often during large earthquakes, there there's fires from the gas lines leaking. So please put down your comments if you felt any of these earthquakes. Thank you very much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll talk to you later. God bless you. Bye.